So I'm a pretty, uh, I'm a pretty uh, quiet guy. Uh, I'm a pretty shy person. And uh, uh, when I'm at a party, and uh, there's people there that I don't talk to, those people think that I'm a jerk. And uh, I know this because once they do get to know me, they're like, dude, this whole time I thought you were such a jerk. I'm like, wow, that's really weird because now I think you're a jerk. And, uh, but that's messed up because I can't even defend myself. I'm like, but I didn't do anything. I'm like, exactly. But, uh, yeah, I'm a pretty optimistic guy. Uh, I think a lot of that has to do with my uh, parents. My mom loves to text me little inspirational quotes. Like, uh, if you never give up, then you'll never fail. When I was a kid, uh, she told me, you gotta stay positive. Because nobody ever got anywhere by being a negative Nancy. Which made me think, you know, one, she thought I was gay. <laughs> uh, what's wrong with a negative Norman? And two, you know, maybe Nancy had a good reason for being so negative. Maybe she had cancer. Maybe she just came out of a bad divorce. You don't know, Mom. <laughs> Why are you going to drag Nancy into this? She's got enough on her plate as it is. Uh, but, uh, just got my hair cut recently. I hate getting my hair cut because yeah. <laughs> someone else just got the hair cut. Uh, I, hate, I hate getting my hair cut because uh, it's expensive and I'm lazy. Uh, I wish my hair was emo. Then it would cut itself. Uh, I saw an infomercial for a DVD set uh, that teaches you how to solve any math problem. They were selling it for $199.95. But if you called it in the next 10 minutes, you'd get it for $9.95. But what's sad is the people that need those DVDs don't realize how good of a deal that is. <laughs> uh, I had the worst math teacher in high school. Uh, I knew she was going to be bad because on the first day of school, I saw she had a book that said math teaching for dummies. Uh, one time she gave us a test and uh, the question said, find x, and then it had some equation. So I circled x, and I wrote, found it. <laughs> what was worse is I was the only one that got that right. <laughs> My teacher was like, finally, somebody that gets it. <laughs> um, pennies cost more than one cent to make, so if you collect all your pennies, you're really just collecting debt. <laughs> um, when I eat at Burger King, I have it my way. When I eat at McDonald's, I'm loving it. When I eat at Subway, it's because I couldn't find a Burger King or a McDonald's. <laughs> um, I hate uh, driving and texting. I think that's stupid for handwritten letters. Uh, the other day I was driving and I hit a chicken. And I was so upset, all I could think was I killed that joke. <laughs> I got out of my car and I saw him laying there. Not like a chicken with his head cut off, but a lot more like a chicken near death from being hit by a car. And I picked him up and I looked into his beady little chicken eyes. I said, do you see the light? Go to the light, chicken. Don't be, a ch or, you know, don't be afraid. And I watched that chicken die, and I was so sad, I was so upset. <laughs> you know, but then I realized, I helped that chicken get to the other side. <laughs> <laughs>